that is always a very special thing because not only is it home for me but it's also a time you that one is able to take away and reflect the last time I was here was uh, November uh, last year uh, I was here then with the governor and a few things you said then, you know, many of which, of course, uh, we're still having to deal with. But this time, I'm here uh, to give your Royal Majesty very good news. On the 11th of April, uh, 2022, I officially declared my intention to run for the position of President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Your Majesty uh, knows that um, I would not have taken the decision lightly. It's one that one has taken with all sense of responsibility. After serving for seven years and a few months as Vice President, and not just serving in that capacity, but on occasion also acting as President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, it is, um, in my view, divine that God has enabled me to serve in this position and to be exposed to practically all of the hard reality and complex and a federation that has all of the different textures that it has. And Majesty, I think that in years our nation will need the kind of leadership that at least has some experience. And I believe that God has provided me with that experience, which is why my, which is why uh, my for president is one which um, I have not only come to uh, to do as a matter of responsibility, um, but as a matter of service also to our country. My desire at all times, Your Majesty, is to serve this country and to do so with everything that I have. And I also would say that God helping me and God helping our party, if indeed 
I am elected as president of this country come May 29th, uh, 3. The pride of place that has become his manifest destiny. It is my great uh, pleasure, of course, Your Majesty, not just to inform you, but also to seek your blessings and your prayers. Thank you very much, sir. Now, what do we do? The evidence for that poor economy that at the time of independence, one naira was two dollars. Today, one dollar is 500 naira. Country cannot support the devaluation of 1,000 times. Something drastic must be done. Sobudo was governor of Central Bank. The major comment I hear is that Soludo is not a banker. So it seems that the main function of the CBN is banking. If that is so, then the government must establish a high powered body to look into the economy. Because we need to reverse what has been happening. A 1,000 times devaluation in our money cannot be done. Nation building, the top device of the Constitution and other measures. But we will forget that these European countries today, what we see today in the European countries is not what they saw at the beginning. What years ago, anybody who has read any history will know the fighting, the quarreling, the killings that created the countries of today. We're only beginning. I think like you did a thousand years ago. And so, if we are going to create a nation out of 250 ethnic groups, because what I see, we can't just do it sitting down. We must have strategies to create that thing. 250 ethnic groups to become one nation. Because we just can't sit down as amateurs dealing with it. We need information. We need instruction. So, Mr. Vice President, I know your antecedents, and I would have expected that right now that we're talking in Nigeria, that we have a national institute here, so that they can do the research and produce information. That is what we need. So we're not going to sit, constitutional conference amateurs. We need information, we need skills. We need people who know, who can lead us. How do we get 250 ethnic groups to become one nation? Without fighting, without quarreling. We need to do these things if we really want Nigeria to survive as a nation. Well, these are some of my thoughts for the future. So, Vice President, what we hope you're asking, what to give you, that you will take some of these considerations into account to lead you so that we have a good and happy Nigeria. God bless you. Thanks for checking out Symphony on YouTube. Please be sure to subscribe and like our videos for updates.